Hi everyone, welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. My name is Casey and I am a 21 year old working and living in San Francisco and happy 2021. I haven't uploaded in a while, but that's because the transition from the holidays back to work is draining. But also I'm editing a fun little family vlog for you all. But before I upload that, I wanna give you guys your favorite videos ever, which is always the what I eat in a days, what I eat in a week, what I eat in a weekends. So you ask, I deliver, here I am delivering. <laughs> I make these videos because I want to promote a healthy relationship with food but also introduce intuitive eating for those of you who don't know what that is. And basically intuitive eating, which what I practice, is eating by your hunger cues. So I eat when I'm hungry, I stop when I'm full, and if I'm craving something sweet or savory, I give my body that because that's what it's asking for. And for me personally, this method of eating has really healed my relationship with food and has made me so much kinder to my body and that's all I want at the end of the day is to appreciate my body for what it does and what it allows me to do so I feel like oftentimes we always neglect the little things our body does and just focus on how it looks and looks aren't everything the ability that we have to be able to walk to move is such a blessing because not everybody has those privileges of doing that with their bodies. But on a lighter note, I want to show you guys the cutest workouts that I'm wearing. My big from my sorority got it for me, so I am so thankful. Thank you, Alisa. I wasn't sure about this color at first, but she is cute. She makes me look tan, which in reality I'm really pale, like in the face, not so much in the body. Uh, I don't know. But that's enough rambling. Let's get started with the video. Hi, hello. So I always start off my morning with a big glass of water and I drink it with a straw because honestly, drinking water with a straw makes it more enjoyable to me and also it makes me drink more water throughout the day. But yeah, I drink water. So it's 9 a.m. now and that's when I typically have my coffee. I drink my coffee first and then I have my breakfast around like 10 because that's typically when I do get hungry. So I always make my iced coffee with ice. Duh. Put the ice in there. Almond milk first because I like the ombre effect it does with the coffee. And this is pre-brewed iced coffee from the day prior. And I just add that, ooh, ooh, just the right amount. And you give it a little mixy mix. And then a little sippy sip. Mm. That's good. And I just ordered a milk frother from Amazon. So I can't wait to elevate my coffee, but that's all for now. <laughs> Hello. So it's now 12.40 and I'm finally gonna eat my first meal of the day. I didn't get hungry until now, but I'm gonna have two eggs, my typical vegan sausage, half an avocado with a lot of spinach. So that's that. I'm gonna turn on the stove and let's get a cooking. So the first step to making a good egg scramble is chopping up your little glizzy. Chop it up and fry it up. This um, process is very therapeutic. You get a lot of pent up anger. Men on dating apps. Oh, okay. Now it's a little nub, but I have to cut it more. Then you add in a lot of spinach to get your greens in and to help your fiber digestion, and it's a great source of iron. Then crack up your two eggs once everything is wilted. Okay. Mm -hmm. 
I am also going to warm one of these gluten-free tortillas up because I want a carb with my eggs. Yeah. Hopefully she looks pretty. Okay. <gasps> She's beautiful. Oh my God. Okay, I'm gonna use this half. <laughs> Look how beautiful she is. We got that avocado, the egg scramble with vegan sausage, spinach, and a gluten-free tortilla. <sighs> and you know what the final touch is? What every person loves, sriracha. So, a little drizzle drazzle. Boom. Taste test. Always so good. Mm, it's my go-to. Always. Hi, so typically I jump rope for like 20, 30 minutes. So let's get it. Ah, a worm. I almost squished this worm. Oh no. No, I'm not squishing this person. Oh my gosh, I'll go over here. I'm listening to Flume. Hi everyone, so I finished my 15 minute jump rope warm out. I, warm out, warm up. <laughs> um, and I typically do like 20 to 30 minutes, but I did a lot of cardio this week and not enough weights, so I'm just gonna stretch and get to the weights. <laughs> Ooh, she hurts. Ooh. Oh my god. Oh. Ooh. I'm not even counting. I'm just gonna do it until I burn out. Ah. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm not clenching at the end because this is just activation. Ooh, I'm just like, oh my god. Workout. I just showered. I'm just gonna have one of these before dinner because I'm hungry. <laughs> this, this legit is a candy bar. Mm. Hi, hello. So it is dinner time, and I have this salmon that has been marinating for the last two days, and I'm going to show you guys what I put on it. I apologize in advance if you guys don't like looking at raw fish, but I marinate my salmon in soy sauce, honey, and wasabi. I know that's a little weird, but the wasabi really adds a little bit of spice that is very complimentary with the honey. So I just marinate that and I'm going to throw it in the air fryer. And I'm just going to put her at 350 for 20 minutes. So to accompany the salmon, I have this leftover seeds of change, brown rice, and quinoa, quinoa rice. And I'm just gonna lay it on here, nice and pretty. Oh, it's a lot. Ooh, these are so easy, and they are nine grams of protein in this whole thing, and they just have a lot of great nutrients and fiber and Overall, they just taste way better than just white rice, in my opinion. So I enjoy this very much. <laughs> I also just added some leftover bok choy that I had because you gotta get your greens in there. And I have slowly started liking bok choy even more now because as a kid I didn't really like it. But now I like it. I think it's really delicious. She is done and she is sizzling and she looks so divine. Yes, honey, beautiful, yes, let's get it, ooh. So I have my dinner here and she looks so divine. Ooh. Yes. Okay. Oh. I get a lot of that soy and honey taste. Very good. Mm. <laughs> I 
so that is everything I eat in a day and just remember it varies day by day not every day is the same but this is a pretty standard view of what I typically eat I always have my egg scramble like that is just a go-to but I hope you guys enjoyed this video I hope to do more what I eat in a day is in a more talkative fashion because I just want to show you guys more of my personality and how I am like as a human being <laughs> so I hope you guys like this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe and I hope to see you guys in the next video bye